What's up, YouTube? Took you two years to find my puppy video. We've been waiting. <laughs> Everyone's been asking for an update, so here you go. Gracie, you gonna get the paper for me? Gracie, will you get the paper? Will you get the paper? First of all, we are so excited to have so many new people here on this channel. Okay, that being paper. said, prepare to be disappointed because this is not necessarily an animal channel. However, I have been in conversations with a couple local animal shelters and it's in the works to try to make it like maybe once a month I can take out animals eligible for adoption out on Uber rides. Thank you very much. Good girl. These things take time though, so be patient with me. But I think it'll be a lot of fun. There's Gracie playing with her friend who you might recognize from the video The Dog Who Called Uber. A personal favorite. Today is the first day of the rest of my life. Why? Speaking of other videos, the most famous person in my Uber? You were a lot cuter when we shot that video. Age hasn't been good to you. Well, that guy has since signed to the Sixers, Kyle O'Quinn. So even though he didn't want anything to do with Gracie, we've forgiven him and uh... Trust the process, baby! Second of all, some of you keen observers have noticed that Susie the Uber puppy has been called Gracie in the other videos. Oh, I'm getting cold. Come on, Gracie, come on. Oh. Thing is, I took the puppy out like the second or third day we had it, and we hadn't decided on a name yet. I was pushing for Susanna because, like I said, she's from Alabama. You know that song? Oh, Susanna, don't you cry for me. Cause I come from Alabama with the banjo on my knee. So everybody was calling her different names for about a week until Gracie was the name that finally won out. I think it was like my great grandmother's name or something. Wasn't even from Alabama. Now for the most asked question, what breed is she? I have no idea. She was found in a barn. Those kind of dogs don't come with papers. We think part Jack Russell, maybe Beagle. I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. And don't waste your time trying to sell me to get one of those tests to find out what breed she is. Listen, Susie don't need a DNA test to find out she 100% that bitch. You get it? Like female dog? The way I see it, no matter what breed she is, I ain't gonna like her more or less. Now for the second most repetitive comment, it was something to the effect of, it's all fun and games until somebody has allergies. Okay, let's play this game. What would happen if somebody had allergies? A, probably nothing. The dog was small. Two, they might sneeze. And D, they could get out. If it was that bad, this is not a prisoner situation. It's an Uber. Like how did you think it was gonna go? Oh, I'm sorry. I can't hold your puppy. I'm allergic. Let's lock the doors and cause them to have a sneezing fit. Ha ha ha. On a related note, this video blowing up has made me realize how weird of a place the internet is. The kind of negativity, and it's the weird negativity, is like, what is with you people? Like, what goes on in your head? I try to make these videos to leave you with a laugh or like a fresh positive perspective. I have it! Eddie! Eddie! And even a video of a puppy, people are saying things like, Now I know how serial killers can make you put your guard down. What? Like, how is that your takeaway from this video? You can't live your life in fear, people. All right, y'all, that's all I got. I never did an update video before. I hope it was at least somewhat entertaining and I answered some of your questions. If you have any more, uh, just ask them in the comments below. I try my best to comment to respond to every comment. I really, really appreciate all you guys watching the videos. I hope you enjoy them. And like I said, hopefully that partnership with the local SPCA comes through soon and I can start having more videos like that. Gracie, you got anything else you want to say? As I said before, if you don't subscribe to the Driver Ed Show, there's a good chance I might develop a stutter. But, but, but please don't do this to me. I don't even like the Kangaroo song anymore. All right, y'all, thanks for watching. Over and out.